Have you ever had moments where your data vanishes crazy fast, even when you're barely online? One minute you have GBs left, next thing, boom, all gone. Don't worry, I've got you. In this video, I'll show you a few simple tricks to stop unnecessary data drain and make your Airtel Pocket Wi-Fi last way longer, whether you're on Android, iPhone, or even laptop. Let's get started. First, let's make sure you're connected to the Wi-Fi. This method works on both phones and laptops, so follow along. Now, let's access the MiFi settings. Open a browser of your choice, and in the address bar, type the MiFi address, which you'll find at the back of the device or the MiFi. The default address is 192.168.1.1, but if that doesn't work, try 192.168.188.1 instead. At the login page, enter the admin password, which is usually found at the back of the MiFi, unless you've changed it. This password is admin. Then log in. Now go to device settings and on the left tap network type settings. At this point, we are going to switch the network to a slower speed, since faster speeds also mean more data consumption. By default, it's set to auto. 4G, 3G, or 2G. Let's change that to 3G. And that's it. But if you notice your internet is extremely slow, simply come back and switch it back to auto for better performance. Next, let's look at how to reduce unnecessary data usage. Starting with Android. When connecting to Wi-Fi on your Android device or phone, enter the password as usual. But before tapping connect, select advanced options. Under metered, select treat as metered, then tap connect. If you're already connected, go to settings, tap Wi-Fi, tap the settings icon next to your network, go to network usage and select treat as metered. On some others, you may have to go down this arrow, then go to metered, then tap treat as metered. This setting prevents heavy app updates and background data usage which should help lower your data costs. You can even save more data by enabling data saver on apps like TikTok and Instagram. On TikTok, go to Settings and Privacy, scroll down to Data Saver, and turn it on. On Instagram, tap Settings, go to Data Usage and Media Quality, and turn Data Saver on. For any other apps you use, check your settings for a Data Saver options. It's usually there. Are you finding value in this video so far? Hit the like button. Thank you. Now, let's move to iPhone and iPad. To save Wi-Fi data on iPhone, connect to Wi-Fi as usual. In the Wi-Fi settings, tap the I icon next to the connected network. Turn on data mode. And that's it. Your iPhone will now use less data. For laptop users, let's begin with Windows. I'm using Windows 11, but it should be similar for Windows 10. While connected to the Wi-Fi, go to Wi-Fi settings. Now tap the I next to the network connected. Scroll down to metered connection and turn it on. This ensures Windows don't download unnecessary updates and background data. On Apple MacBooks, make sure you're connected to the Wi-Fi network first. Click the Wi-Fi icon, then go to Wi-Fi settings. Tap the three dot next to the connected Wi-Fi you want and go to network settings. Turn on low data mode and you're good to go. Final reminder, this low data mode or metered connection settings apply only to the networks you've set them on. If you connect to a new Wi-Fi, you'll need to enable them again for that network. If the video gave you some value, like and subscribe to the channel. And here is another video I think you'll love. Catch you there.